An appellate court sentenced the so-called spin kick assailant to 20 years in prison amid growing social concern over his brutal attacks on a female stranger apparently for the purpose of rape. The Busan High Court made the ruling against the assailant who was given a 12-year prison term by a district court last October for indiscriminately assaulting the victim in her 20s near her home in central Busan earlier that year. Last May 22nd, a man randomly followed a woman back to her apartment at around 5 o'clock in the morning. And as the woman was waiting for the elevator, he struck the back of her head with a roundhouse kick, knocking her out and then kept assaulting her until she passed out. He was sentenced to 12 years imprisonment by the district court after being convicted of attempted murder. But prosecutors have changed the charges to attempted rape murder after detecting his DNA in the jeans worn by the victim at the time of the assault and demanded a prison term of 35 years in the appellate court hearing. Convicting him of the attempted rape and murder charges, the court said he committed the crime after viewing the victim as a means of committing a sexual assault. The appellate court also ordered that the defendant wear a location tracking device for 20 years and his personal information be disclosed in public communications networks for 10 years and banned him from employment in child-related institutions for 10 years. The victim expressed disappointment regarding the prison sentence. <laughs> the victim repeatedly expressed fears about possible reprisal by assailant once he is released from prison. <laughs>